Now, let me say one word to you. As a, this is my departing service as the pastor of the Heritage Hills Baptist Church. And I thank God for the last eight and a half years that I've had the privilege to serve this dear, dear congregation. But uh, I want you to know that even though Doug Ferguson is leaving, Jesus is intact. And his church has a glorious future. And I'm thankful that over these next several weeks, there's some tremendous preachers that are lined up that will be here and, and preaching. And the online services are going to continue on. And I encourage you to pray. Pray for Heritage Hills. Those of you who are members of Heritage Hills Baptist Church, I want to encourage you in the Lord today. And I, I want to urge you, pray and be faithful to your church. And, and whatever church you're a part of, I urge you to pray for that church and pray for your pastor and pray for your uh, pastoral staff and the church leadership. And be faithful in your giving. Don't let your church suffer during these days, but you be faithful in your giving. And if you're a member of another church, then don't you send your money to Heritage Hills Baptist Church. You, you support your church and be faithful in, uh, in being and doing what God would have you to do in these days. All right. Let me lead this in. I have somebody to recognize. All right. Mr. Jeff Ross is coming. And then I will step back up and lead us in the closing prayer. Pastor Doug just said, this is his last Sunday. So uh, we've got some mail for you from the members of Heritage Hills. Uh, some well wishes for you and, uh, you and Jim. Thank you. Thank you so very much. This is this is so nice. I didn't want <laughs> didn't plan on being real personal, but it, what a what a nice gesture. And we love you, dear folks, and we thank God for the privilege of being here these last eight and a half years. And I know a lot of folks weren't able to do so, but we had a tremendous, tremendous parade of love yesterday at our house as our church members rode by in their cars, but we couldn't get together because of the COVID-19. But, uh, but oh, how encouraging that was to John and to me. I think I lost about five pounds of shedding tears yesterday afternoon. But uh, what, a, what a joy and what a delight. It's been my wonderful privilege to serve this dear church. And I'm excited about all that God has for the days that lie ahead.